the ROCAF Seaburn Specialists and the Air Force Seaburn Specialists, we come together and we um, test their capabilities. It's an opportunity for us to come together and learn um, what the Air Force brings and what the uh, ROCAF bring. It's really important because although we have similar capabilities, we also have very different ones. And if we don't train together, we don't know um, where our um, lymphacs are. And this is an opportunity for us to do that. So if there is an event, we can just work well together and, and um, understand what roles we're going to play. We're on their stuff, aren't they? Uh, in the beginning of the training, the uh, Rokov Seaver Unit and the USF Seaver Unit both rode right the uh, recon vehicle. And after that, there was a biological uh, case in the inside of this site. The USF did the recon, and after that, the Rokov Seaver Unit did the decon. There's a communication issue and the language issues. We have to make plans to, to cope together in the real world scenarios. And the most important thing is to elevate our teamwork with the USF and the ROCAF. We often have new individuals come in and, and, and ROCAF also does. Um, and just not ever being overseas and working with um, a, a different country, sometimes we don't know that they're very similar to what we do. And, and the only way that we're going to find out is when we do events like this and come together and just see how we mesh. And I think that's part of the goal when we do these, these training events.